Hey beautiful budgeting friends, welcome back or welcome to my channel if you are new here. If you're a returning subscriber of mine, you already know. Hey boo, thank you so much for being back and being patient with me you guys. I'm trying to figure out a recording schedule to go along with work and making binders and envelopes and all that jazz. So. I'm here today, so happy Thursday to everybody. I'm so sorry if the lighting is a little bit off. I don't know where the sun went. It completely disappeared on me, and yeah. So we are going to be cash stuffing um, my bills binder, my cash envelopes. Um, so yes, I do want to give a quick shout out though real quick to um, Emily Budgets. Um, I won her giveaway. And she sent me some goodies. So I just want to show you guys the things that she sent me because, hello, super adorable. Um, so she sent me a bookmark. How cute is this? It says, shoot for the moon. Even if you miss, you will land among the stars. Love that. She also sent me an envelope with a 1K placeholder with some crystal sticker, a crystal sticker on it. So that is super cute. These little moon sticker little notepads. Super adorable. She got me a, what is this, a mud mask. So I'm definitely gonna use this. And that is a little note that she wrote me. Some really adorable stickers and this super cute notebook. I absolutely love notebooks, so I already started using it. <laughs> and um, I actually did my little breakdown on here. I did not um, use my iPad just cause I've just been kind of feeling the pen and paper lately. So thank you, boo. Thank you, Emily. You guys be sure to subscribe to her channel. Um, she's also a cash stuff, cash stuff for in budgeter. Um, I'm going to have her channel linked in the description. We're going to cash stuff today. $50 into my bills binder and 245 into my, um, cash envelope. So let's set this money up. We got 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 220, 230, 240, 250, 260, 270, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. A little baby, $295. Not a lot, you guys. Um, just to give you guys a quick rundown, if you're here just for the cash stuffing, I will insert a timestamp so that you can go to that. I just want to give you guys a little update as to why I didn't record last week. Y'all, since the pandemic started, what, two years ago, we have not had COVID, and lo and behold, boom, bam, my son and husband started feeling um, like body aches and sick and stuff last Saturday. Um, just kind of came out of nowhere. It happened in the evening, and so Sunday by Sunday morning, they were both like in a lot of pain. Their body was hurting. Um, so we went ahead and all got tested Sunday morning. We did a rapid test and we got the results in two and a half, three hours. And my hubby and son tested positive. Mine came back negative. Um, so I was kind of like, okay, cool. You know, I'm good. But because we're in the same household, you know, um, my job wanted me to also quarantine with them. And then of course, even though I came back testing negative, on Monday, it hit me like a ton of bricks, you guys. When I tell you the body aches when it comes to COVID is insane, it's freaking insane. Like, I was in so much pain, um, and my son was in so much pain, my husband was in so much pain, and it, just, it was just horrible. Um, luckily, I was able to, like, tend to them on Sunday and early Monday before it hit me. Um, and then, you know, and then they were able to kind of tend to me, and it was just crazy, so... Last week, my husband and I actually did not work. So therefore, this week, we did not receive a paycheck. We normally get paid on Wednesday. My husband gets paid Wednesdays. So I get paid Thursdays. Um, so our checks from last week, basically, we had to split into two. So we had money for last week and money for this week. So we are working with a low budget, but that is life. And I'm just glad that we were um, able to fully recover from COVID right away. It kind of lasted maybe just 48 hours, I would say, for each of us. And, you know, even now, though, I still feel like some slight, like, sometimes I'll feel like a little achiness in my, like, in my knees or, like, my arm or something. Um, I have had, like, a small, tiny bit of, like, a weird cough, but um, I'm completely negative, so that's good. It's just maybe something that lingers. Um, a couple of women's issues that 
just happened to pop up whenever I got COVID and it's just a lot of weird stuff. So long story short, we're healthy. We're, I'm thankful that we're okay. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an update why I didn't post last week. Just felt like crap and, you know, just wanted to lay around and not do much of anything. So jumping right in, let's go ahead and start with, um, my Bills binder. Let me move this. Isn't she sexy, you guys? Isn't she sexy? That is the Moterm that I won from Christy over at the Mom Life. Um, I won that giveaway and it's just so hot. I love it. Love it, love it. So, you guys, not stuffing a whole lot, um, but we do have to stuff a, a couple things. Rent is not going to get anything. Like I said, we had to split this last paycheck into two. So, because we didn't get paid this week, we are just going to hit all of rent with next paycheck, which is next week. So, nothing for rent. Um, subscriptions is going to get 15 How is y'all's week been? I cannot believe tomorrow is Friday already. This week has flown by. Flown freaking by. <clears throat> subscriptions got 15. So 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40 in subscriptions. That should be plenty to cover our um, Netflix and stuff. Credit card is getting $5 only. Bare minimum stuffing today, you guys. <clears throat> So five for credit card. So we have 10, 20, 25, and 30 in credit card. You guys, and I am so excited because today finally in our office, <clears throat> we got like a Wi-Fi extension service box thingy. I don't know what it's called, but long story short, in my office, we do not have no cell phone service. So it's been hectic to not have a, a cell phone to use at work, just our landline phones. And you just feel so disconnected from the world. And finally, we got phone service in our office today. So I'm excited because if you did not catch my community post, I made a post saying that I'm excited because now I can actually watch and listen to y'all's videos because there's so many videos that I need to catch up on. I love supporting you guys. I love watching y'all's videos. It's just hard. It's just been harder lately because... I don't have cell phone service for like eight hours out of the day. So now I can finally do that and I'm just so freaking excited. So yay, you'll be seeing me comment more, you guys. Phone bill's gonna get $25. Uh, let's see, loans is not getting anything. Amazon is only gonna get $5. Next week, we do need to order that dog food from Amazon. So 25 goes to that, or five goes to that. Nothing in cons, that's our furniture, and nothing in light bills. So that does it for our bills. I'm so excited because next week, I'm also gonna be starting some savings challenges, starting back up my sinking funds, you guys. Everything is finally coming together. Bills are getting caught up. Oh, it's just been a whirlwind of stuff. But with that being said, I do want to announce my giveaway winner for my um, binder slash wallet that I showed in my last video. Um, I just did it kind of spur of the moment. <clears throat> so I do have the names of everyone that entered here. You did not have to be publicly subscribed for this giveaway. I did not mention that. So everybody that basically commented got to, um, or that commented hashtag binder got to enter in the giveaway. So let's go ahead and pick that winner right now. And it is Angie Budget and Debt. So I will be reaching out to you, or if you're watching this, go ahead and comment down below or message me on Instagram. I'll put my Instagram name here, or you can also send me an email. My email will be linked in the description below. So congratulations to you, boo. You're going to be getting the binder sent out to you tomorrow so hit me up um or i'll message you i'm not sure if i have you on instagram but if i do um i will message you and so that i can get your address so we can get that sent over to you so thank you to everybody that entered into the giveaway i think i'm going to be getting another one of those binders and doing another giveaway soon i i i feel like everybody liked it so why not you know so congratulations boo i'm going to pull out my 
my my my my my um envelopes here and i know my envelopes don't really go with the motor but i love my envelopes i don't know if i want to get rid of these yet not yet I, I don't know i'm still feeling them so let me just pull this out and so i've been stuffing in prop like y'all know um but we d i did get some cash back whenever i did some spending last week so i did have a few ones left over and i realized yes it's convenient for me just to, to swipe my card and just use the prop money i don't have to go to the bank because the bank is a little bit far from me now um and yeah but i need to stop being lazy because i realized i'm missing out on saving my ones and saving my change so i'm going to start that back up so i have four dollars to throw into let me grab it a huge pickle jar that I need to just clean a little bit better try to get the sticker off I'm gonna put these ones away to the side that's gonna go into the pickle jar because I'm gonna start saving my ones again because that is a must any little bit counts and I'm busting out the good old change jar who also has not been treated well lately I don't think I've put change in here in like a month or more so let me just pull out this change real quick So yeah, you guys, I realized like I can't be lazy and not go to the bank. I need to um, start pulling my cash, spending cash so that I can save my change. Because even though this jar is little, every time I fill it up, it's a little over 50 bucks. So I need to really get back to doing that. All right, love. So moving on to spending, we're just going to do $40 for spending, $20 for myself, $20 for hubby. And I just send that to him via Cash App. Everything I pretty much do with my Cash App, which now they're trying to say if you, if you get sent $600 or more um, or something like that within the year, you have to pay taxes on it or something. I don't know. Something weird like that's going on. I need to really look more into it. Comment down below if you've heard something similar. Um, alrighty. Gas money is going to get $30. That has been working lately. Gas is still outrageous but not bad as like it, it was really bad for a while it's calmed down quite a bit um and we don't really we haven't really been going anywhere especially we had covid last week and still just with this whole omicron variant and it being hella contagious um we've been just staying home so um all right out to eat is actually not gonna get anything we've been doing really good about not going out to eat and i really want to stick to that i've been sticking to my meal plans and all that jazz um, let's see household we are gonna put 15 in household because I do need some toiletries 15 in there and let's see groceries we're gonna do the 150 in groceries because I've been cooking at home more so 120 40 150 and y'all know I do two grocery runs, $75 a run, because we use the Cash App Boost. I did do a little explanation video in my last video on what the Cash App Boosts are. So we do that so that we can use those coupons. And then lastly is going to be Caleb spending, and he is going to get $10 sent to his Cash App. For his chore money and yeah that about wraps everything up you guys short and sweet and to the point congratulations to my giveaway winner and yes you guys I hope you'll have an amazing rest of the week I will catch you guys on Monday I do want to do another um, budget with me I'm thinking about changing things up a little bit so bear with me if it's gonna look a little bit different I don't know if I'll use the iPad still or if I'm going to try to go the paper and pen route. Comment down below what do you guys prefer seeing, paper and pen route or do you guys like seeing um, digital on the tablet? So yeah, you guys have an amazing week, weekend. I'll catch you on Monday like I said. Stay blessed, stay safe. Don't forget that you matter, you are loved, you're amazing, you're beautiful, you're special, you're awesome, and I love y'all. Bye.